Alright guys, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. In the last part, we found out that there were multiple people at the studios during the scene of the crime, so we cannot limit our suspects to Will Powers, our defendant, just yet. And we had the privilege of meeting Mr. Salmonella last time, the director. Look at this sweaty fuck. But anyway, now it's time to... I think we, t we finished talking to him, right? Yeah, we did. Okay. So we need to figure out where to go next, and I have no idea. So let's figure it out. I probably should have f found out where to go beforehand, but I didn't. Oh, here we go. Oh no, she's back! Aha! You again! Eek! How rude, acting like you've seen a ghost! You certainly got back to your post quickly. Oh, the police took me away, they did! They pulled out a spare steel samurai costume! Oh no, they actually had her try it on! <laughs> Told me to put it on! Can you imagine? How could I, a sweet little old lady, wear a giant suit like that? Mr. Powers is pretty tall. As soon as they saw there was no way I could wear it, they let me go. I guess that would rule out her being the murderer. Yeah, no shit, we made that up. Anyway, know this, whippersnapper. This old lady never forgets a slight or insult. And you won't get any information out of me. My lips are sealed. You sure are talking a lot for someone with sealed lips. Starting now! One, two, three! Mm. Oh, she there. She literally did it. This lady's too much. Always has been. Alright, let's try and talk to her and see if something happens. About that kid you said you saw. If I see him again, I'm taking him down! Nick! Look at her eyes! She's serious! Oh gosh, she's angry face. Let's get rid of that. About the director, the one who was here on the day of the murder. If I see him again, I'm taking him down! Oh, she's, she's on the rampage. She's losing it. Okay, well, there's no... There's no reasoning with her now, is there? Now, right, let's go check out all the other places. Anything in Studio 1? No. Shouldn't be anything in Studio 2 either, I'm guessing. This is just gonna be me moving around and figuring things out. Nada. I don't think I can even show old bag anything that would make her change. Oh, she's normal again. If you want to call that shit normal. Oh, here we go. Oh, look! Hey! Hey, wait! I'll bet he came in right through that drain. Hey, um, Kittyo. What's your name, sport? I'm not a kid, so don't talk to me like that. Classic kid stuff. Huh? But you are a kid. What a rude little brat. That's no way to talk to an adult. You're 17. I don't see no adults here, hippie fashion chick. Hippie fashion? Nick, I think I'm being mocked. You gotta hand it to Maya. She's pretty sharp and pretty mad. I'm Cody. Cody Hackins. Hey, that's my brother's name. Call me Kittyo again and I'll cut you down where you stand, evildoer. Oh, look at his sword. He's gonna cut us. Oh, God. All right, let's try talking to him. Well, he's got a camera, and we're talking about a kid who takes pictures all the time, so this must be the one. Oh, Steel Samurai. So you're a fan of the Steel Samurai? How dare you utter that name, evildoer! What do you mean? We're on the Steel Samurai side! Ha! Ha ha! You can't fool me! Okay, then what's the last line said by the innkeeper in episode 8? Ha! Easy! Like some fries with that? <laughs> God, they're both super fans. This is a fan off. Hmm, not that, kitty -o. Watch it. What are they doing? Say, you heard anything about the incident the other day? Uh-oh. He's quiet. You were here, weren't you? Did you see anything? He, he, he always, the Steel Samurai always wins, always. Yeah, I saw him, I saw everything. Oh, crap. But... But no way am I telling you, losers! What? Wait! Let me go! Oh, he's gone. Huh? Something fell off the table when he bumped into it on his way out. Oh, what's that? A bottle. Why was this sitting there, I wonder? Empty bottle. Oh, well, now we've got that. Anyway, what was that kid saying? He saw everything. Interesting. Oh, no, I don't want to examine. I don't want to examine. Ah, go away. Um, what is, does it say what it is? Sleeping pills. Okay, well, 
This should be useful at some point in time. All right, now what? Let's see if he ran out here. Huh? Where's that old windbag? Ought of her to leave her post. Hey! Nick, that was her. Stop! Whippersnapper! Oh, he's probably following the kid. Yep. Natch! What? Uh-oh, she tripped. <laughs> oh, no. She might die. Old people die like that, you know. They can fall, and it's all over. That's sad. Maya sure looks happy. No, don't be happy. Dead people. Okay, then. Well. Can we talk to Will? Can we talk to Will? Hey, Willy. I'm never gonna call you Willy again. Can't talk to you, though. So, bye. Okay, she's chasing after the... Oh, wait. Can I look at stuff? Can I get the key? Oh, I can get the key. Hey, Nick. Now's our chance. Let's check out the guard station. Good idea. Yeah, I wish I had thought of it. This is it, Nick. The trailer key. The key to that trailer in Studio 2. We'll be borrowing this, right, Nick? Of course we are. <laughs> Need to get in there. There was a crash like 80 minutes ago. So if someone died or was dying or in trouble, they're probably dead. Yay, progress. I'm making progress. This is very important, you guys. All right, let's... Do we have to examine the key on the door? Probably. I wonder if the key we borrowed from the guard station will work. It opened. Great! Let's go, Nick! She seems eager all of a sudden. Well, you first, Nick! Ah, not that eager. Well, she's scared. I'm kind of nervous, too. We heard a thump in the trailer. Okay. <gasps> Whoa. Hey, she's a smoker, too. I want I want a long cigarette thing like that. That'd be pretty dope. No, I don't. I should quit smoking, you guys. On the real. Okay. Eek! Someone's in here! Names. She's gonna have a very, like, distant voice. By the way, if you guys were <laughs> bummed out about me not doing a Salmonella voice, I'm really sorry, but that was not gonna work out whatsoever, so that's how it's gonna be now. Our names? Um... We're WP's lawyers, and, um... I see. And who might you? D. Vasquez, the producer. Oh, okay, so here's the other person. D. Vasquez, she's quite beautiful. Uh, she looks like she's seen some rough times. She's... She maybe had that beauty once, but I feel like it's worn down by the sands of time or something. Alright, see if we can get her to talk. Stop puffing on that for a second. I was wondering if you could tell me about the day of the murder. Miss Vasquez? Script. Excuse me? Script. I'm looking for a script. A script? The Steel Samurai, episode 13. I need it. Um, could we ask you a bit about the day of the murder? I need to read it. Okay. We're getting nowhere fast. Yeah, exactly. Alright, I'm... Okay, I'll try tell doing all the things, but I, I have a feeling I need to go get her script before she'll actually talk. Um, we'd really like to ask you about the Steel Samurai. Miss Vasquez? It's on TV every week. That's all I have to say about that. Nick! She's telling us to go watch TV? The nerve of her! Hey, don't get mad at me. Bitch. About the director, Salmonella, was it? What exactly is his role here? Perhaps I didn't make myself clear? I'm looking for a script. I can't be bothered with anything else. Nick? Are all people in the entertainment business this weird? It seems like it, at least at Global Studios. It's starting to look like it. Nick, let's get out of here. Isn't there someplace else we have to check? Yeah. Wait. Yes? If you see Manella, give him this. Why do we have to do your errands? Bitch, I'm just asking you to do this for me because I'm in charge. I... I don't think I like her. <laughs> don't cry. She'll take it as a sign of weakness. And then she'll destroy you. Alright, we'll give it to him if you see him. Vasquez's memo. Alright, well... <laughs> you were fun to talk to, thanks! Later! Alright, should we go find... 
Mr. Manella. Well, I feel... We need a script, too. There's a script in here. Can we get it? I want to see, because it's sitting right there. But I don't know if that's actually anything. Hey, look! That's the chair the director sits in! Okay. Uh, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. Action! Okay, I guess I can't. Just kidding. Maybe Manila has the script. That's true. Okay. Think about this, Electro. Think! Uh, old bag is still chasing after that child. Okay, and... Gosh, there's a lot of moving in this. We got a, we got a lot of places to go. All right. I didn't really want to come see you again, but, you know, I kind of have to. What's the memo say? Oh, the memo reads, bring me the script. Oh, well, if I read that, I wouldn't have just gone for the soup shit. Here, I got this from the producer. Huh? Bring the script for episode 13. Episode 13. Where did I put that one? I must have left it somewhere. Uh-oh. My ass is pwned if I don't find it. Nick! It might be quicker to just look in all the places where he's likely to have been. I agree. Okay, so now do I go to Studio One? Did I jump the gun again? I think I did. Crap. Sorry. Sorry! We're moving. We're moving. There's a monkey. We're moving. We're moving. There's a script. Oh, yeah. See, we can do it. We're back at the scene of the crime. Let's find what we need and get out of here quick, Nick. Delio. This is the script. Haha. -ha. I'm so smart. Hey, look! That's- Oh, shit. Oh, take a look around that chair for me, would you? Remember that script the director was talking about? Okay, thank God. I was like, if this isn't it, then I really have no idea. Didn't he say he'd left it somewhere? Aha! Found it, Nick! Why is it covered in, like, poop? Good work! Nasty-ass script. I mean, if that bitch wants to touch it, she can. You got your script, lady. We are returning. Be nice to us this time. I doubt it. Okay. Now that you have the script, do you want to talk to us about some shit? Here, we found it. Your script. Ah. Script handed to D. Vesquez. Um, uh, you're not going to talk to us? Quiet. <clears throat> I'm reading. Just you hold on. What's the big idea? Who do you think you are anyway? And do you know even... Whoa. And do you even know who we are? Powers lawyers. Oh, she was listening. Am I a suspect? No, it's just... Well, no, but... You wanted to know about the day of the murder? Yes, anything you could tell us would be a big help. You know there was a meeting here at noon? Yes, with the director and the people from the network. Correct. Now listen closely. None of the people in this trailer that afternoon went to Studio One. It was impossible for us to leave. Oh, I thought I'd bring something up really quick. Sorry, I just realized. If you hear, like, random clicking in some of my videos, it's because when I do this, I absentmindedly play with uh, the Wii wrist strap. So I just, like, click on the little thingamabob. But yeah, sorry, I need to stop doing that. It was impossible for us to leave. Impossible? Why? The path was blocked. The path? Monkey! It was the monkey. The blocked path. On the day of the murder, the path that leads here was blocked? <clears throat> you saw Mr. Monkey on the way here, correct? He has a name! It's Mr. Monkey. Mr. Monkey? The monkey with the broken head. Oh, right, that. What an original name. I probably would have done that. Oh, <laughs> look dumb as hell. Its head fell over in the wind on the day of the murder. They didn't start moving the head out of the way until after three. It was after four by the time the path was unblocked. Capiche? Everyone in this trailer was stuck here until the path was cleared. Stuck in this trailer. Stuck until after four. Hammer died at 2.30. Thus, none of us could have gone to Studio One. What? It's true. A crane came just after three to move the head. We called some people in to clear the way. I'm sure they corroborate my story. But wait! What if the head fell over after 2.30? Then you could have gone to Studio One. 2.30, the time of death. Very well. Come. 
Oh, we're following her. Okay, that was fast. That's Mr. Monkey. When it wasn't broken, it announced the time in ooks. One ook per hour. Ook, 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 ook. Always with the ooking. It is a monkey after all. This is awfully familiar. Takes me back to my rhythm heavy fever days. Check its head. The clock inside stopped when it broke. Nick, it stopped at 2.15. Oh, shit. 2.15? That's right. Let's see Mr. Monkey's head again. This path was blocked from 2.15 till after 4. Therefore, we're innocent. Mr. Hammer died in Studio One at 2.30. Oops. See? Goodbye. Oh, she's really leaving. Okay. Yay, we got Mr. Monkey in the court record. Hooray. What do we do, Nick? There isn't anyone besides Ms. WP who could have killed Hammer. It's over. We're finished. Sure doesn't look good. Guess we should head back to the office and plan our strategy. All right, at least they're telling me what to do because, again, I was not sure. Yep, she's still gone. She fell. She's dead, you guys. She's dead. It's official. All right. Let's come back and regroup. Now what? We're fresh out of clues. Everyone's alibi is watertight. We don't even have any promising leads. Things are looking pretty grim. It's a little early for giving up, don't you think? I don't know who this is. Huh? You've got one lead. Ha! <laughs> it's Mia! Of course, we're hopeless, and here she comes to save the day. What took you so long? Sorry, Phoenix. Maya has trouble calling me unless she's really in trouble. Oh, we're, we're really fucked then. Right. Oh, wait. I guess that means we're really in trouble. <laughs> I'd say so. What did you mean we have one lead? The boy, of course. That's true. He saw everything. But he's not telling us because he's a jerk. His kids are jerks. I don't know. He didn't sound like he was going to help us at all. I'm sure you can find some way of bringing him over to your side. Either way, we should get back to the studios. That boy is our last hope, Phoenix. Thanks. Now I'm more worried than I was before. Well, we got Mia on our side now, so this should be a little bit easier. Let's go back. Oh, no! She's alive! <sighs> okay. What's wrong? Whipper Sever! She's been chasing that boy this whole time. Wow, that was a long time. When, when I catch him, I... <sighs> Sounds like she hasn't had any luck catching him. I, I got a hostage now, whippersnapper. Oh. <clears throat> a hostage? Let's figure that out then. What's the hostage? I want to know. When that boy was running away, he dropped this and ran. <sighs> He'll come back for this one. It's kind of hard to understand her with all that huffing and puffing. Phoenix, that hostage might be what we need. Cody might talk to us if we give him that. Good idea. Miss Oldback, might I... No! I'm catching that brat if it's the last thing I do. Phoenix, do you have anything you might trade with her? A trade, hmm? I wonder. I don't think we have anything. Let's see. Do you want Mr. Monkey's head? How about the card key I stole? Hey, that... That's a card... Studio One? Right, a card key to Studio One. I... I could visit poor Hammer. Wait, is that right? I'd like to visit... He died. Whew. I was his... His fan. You don't have your own card, Miss Oldbag? Studio One isn't my turf. You'll let me borrow... Borrow it then? Wow, that was actually right. I didn't think that was. I thought I was just fucking around. I thought she was just gonna get pissed that I stole it. If I give her the card key, then I won't be able to get into Studio One. Lend her the car key. We have no need for that. Why don't you let her borrow it, Phoenix? I guess it can't hurt. Here you go, Miss Oldbag. All right. Listen to me, Sonny. I don't like having deaths to no whippersnappers. You take this, and we're even. Deal? Looks like comic books? Trading cards, maybe? I don't, I don't remember. What's this? A Steel Samurai trading card? Oh, okay. That sneaky kid dropped it. I figure it's pretty important to him, though. Thank you. I may have a use for this. This must be the hostage she was talking about. Awesome. Right, I'm off. There she goes, hobbling off toward the studio. Oh, she like broke her leg or some shit. Is he back in the employee area, I wonder? Oh, sweet. Guess he is. Ha ha! Hey! Oh, never mind. Oh, there he is. Hey you, wait a second. Stop it. Phoenix, was that the boy? 
Yeah, his name's Cody Hackins. I think he ran into the dressing room. All right, let's move fucking more. Great. Okay. He's sure to be in here somewhere. Found you. And he's gone again. He's getting away. Come back. There, he's back. How did she... Hey there. Would you mind helping us out? Please? I'm Cody. Hello, Cody. I'm Mia. Mia Fay. Nice to meet you. Yo! And I'm Phoenix Wright. Who asked? <laughs> Phoenix, you can't get anywhere with this kid. Phoenix, you can take it from here. No, I can't. Yeah, we're not qualified. Alright, let's give him that card. Will this help? Cody, this look familiar? Hey, my you are! You are, huh? You are, you know, ultra rare. That card's really hard to get. Man, for a grown up, you sure are dumb. I'll give you this if you help me. But that's my card. By offering me something I already own, you're in effect eschewing. I don't know that word. The very basis of our consumer society, namely the principle of fair trade. Man, for a grown up, you sure are dumb. Jeez, talking my face off right now with knowledge. What are these? Te they teach these kids in school these days? Quantum physics? Whatever. I don't need that card. Huh? I got a double. Just keep it. It's yours. Oh crap, now we have no leverage. What? After I went through all that trouble? If you want to trade, find me a really rare card. Really rare? You mean there's something rarer than ultra rare? Ultra rare premium cards are way rarer than plain ultra rare cards. Come on! Man, for grown up, you sure are dumb! Premium rare, right? I feel like we're talking about stakes. Probably are. Alright. Well, Mia got him to talk at least. Problem is, we don't have anything to give him to make him talk to us more. Um. Crap. Nothing. Nothing. Shit. Shit! I don't know what to do! Is Divas guy still in here smoke? Oh, there's something to do here. Okay. Oh, hi! Hey, what are you doing here? Oh, well, I had to arrange some stuff. Um, yes. The, um, girl with you, doesn't she seem a little different? Yeah, she's got huge tatas. She's the same as always. Yeah, let's, let's play that off. Same as always. Okay, whatever you say. Alright, what have you been up to, Penny? Have you seen that boy since then? Nope. You missed it, though. The security lady was chasing around after the boy so fast I thought she'd collapse. She did. Of course, he got away in the end. Boy, was she mad. Actually, we saw them. How's the old windbag doing? She was squeezing donuts through her clenched fist back at the guard station. <laughs> some people take their jobs a little too seriously. Let's talk about the victim for some reason. Are all the posters on the wall here of Hammer? Yes. It's really a terrible loss for the studios. But his popularity had been waning recently, right? That's true. Then again, after what happened... After what happened? You mean you don't know about Hammer? Oh, information, huh? No, what? I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said anything. Oh, great. Come on. Wait, now you have to tell me. What happened with Mr. Mr. Hammer? Mr. Hammer. I'm sorry. I'm probably not the one who should tell you. Uh-oh. Why do I get the feeling something's being covered up here? Do you like cards? Do you know anything about this? Hey, that's a Steel Samurai trading card. I collect those, actually. I'm one card away from a complete set. A complete set? Yeah, a set of one of each card. Huh. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. That's it. That's the card I need. You don't know how long I've been looking for it. Uh. I don't care what kind of girl you might think I am. I need that card. Oh. <laughs> please, I beg of you. Please trade with me. Look how intense she is. Trade with you? Yes, trade cards. Look, I'll even trade you an ultra rare premium card. Boom. There it is. That's what I need. It's a good deal for your ultra rare. Please. Phoenix, can't you see she's desperate? What's everybody getting so excited about? Of course we're going to trade this. Thanks. And this is for you. Erp card. We got the erp card. Yahoo! And there she goes. Doesn't doing good things like that make you feel great? Yeah. Yeah, it does. Thanks. 
All right. Back to see Cody. Hopefully he's in the same spot and he's not fucking running around and stuff. Man, if I hadn't done that, I would have been moving around forever and I probably would have ended off the episode lost in nothingness and despair. But we good. We got the ERP card. Have an ERP card. The things we do for justice. Yeah, so wait, that's it. That's the last ultra rare ERP card I need. Come on, give it to me, please. You gotta give it to me. Wow, I've never seen him so eager. Right, okay, how about a trade? You're on. I'll give you a samurai spirit and throw in an evil magistrate to boot. No, 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 not that kind of trade. I don't want cards, I want information. Huh, you sure? Bye by me. Gave ERP card to Cody. ERP. Okay, Phoenix, let's hear what he has to say. If he knows something that could help us, we can have him take the stand tomorrow. Have him on trial? I mean, I guess. So, you like to steal Samurai? He's so cool! Dude, I guess. You're judging him by his looks. You have to look at his actions, at his life. I'm being lectured on life by a grade schooler. You like him too, don't you? Uh, oh, me? Yeah, I am love the Steel Samurai. So tell me what your favorite thing about the Steel Samurai is. <laughs> Willpower's acting is completely up to par. His fighting skills? I guess. Gotta think of something. I like it when he, uh, he vanquishes his foes. Yeah! Wazam! The Steel Samurai always wins. Always! Check this out. It's my fan album. Aww. It's all pictures of the Steel Samurai. I go to every live performance! Those stupid publicity stunts where they beat each other up in public. I always take a picture when the Steel Samurai lands the final blow. Wazam! I got them all! I never missed one! A perfect collection! Check it out! My new digital camera! Wow, that's very impressive! The newest model, isn't it? You bet, lady! I just got it for my birthday! My album has a name, wanna hear it? The Steel Samurai, Path to Glory. That's pretty good. He's a, he's a very clever yet precocious young child. The Steel Samurai always wins, always! Hey, if you want this, you can have it, lady! Oh, wow. Really? Are you sure? Yeah, I took these with the digital camera. I got all the data at home, so I can make always make another one. Well, then I'm happy to accept. Thank you. Thank you, Mia, for letting your boobs get us stuff from a kid. What's with people always giving stuff to Mia? What a life. Just kidding, she's dead. All right, well, let's see if we can get some real stuff out. You were here on the day of the incident, right? Yeah. Did you see anything unusual? Cody. Cody, he needs to know because he's fighting for justice. And look at my boobs, and you can tell me. Isn't that the Steel Samurai's motto? For great justice? You have to help us fight for great justice, too. I... I saw... I saw everything! Well, well. We might get some useful information out of him yet. Cody, I need to ask you something very important. What did you see on the day of the incident? I got here that day around two. I had to come in through the woods out back so that that old lady wouldn't see me. I got kind of lost though. I was in there for maybe a half hour or so. Then I finally got to the studio. After that... What is it, Cody? <laughs> space. Oh! The Steel Samurai killed the bad guy! He used his samurai spear! Just like always! One shot, one kill! It happened so fast, I got scared. I went home after that. Okay. I see. It must have been hard for you. Man, you say those nice things, but it's so obvious you aren't speaking from the heart. Right. Mia? Take care of this for me. I think we could say for sure this means the Steel Samurai did it. True enough. And the director has an alibi, so it wasn't him. Indeed. So, the only person left to it could have been his Will Powers. I have to admit, it's kind of a shock. But if you put this boy on the witness stand, your client will be guilty for sure. Let's not call him then. I think that would be wise. Best to leave this one alone. Not so fast, pal! Oh, no. Did you hear everything? Yeah, he heard everything. This boy here is a key witness. And he's under police protection, starting now. Come on, son. You've got a rendezvous with me down at the precinct. No, I ain't going. Wah! <laughs> that didn't go so well. We're back to zero leads. And now we have a serious handicap in court. What are we going to do, Mia? 
Well, hmm. I really need to be going. Oh no, right now? Don't worry, Phoenix. I'm sure you'll be fine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come to the trial tomorrow, please. I need you there. Phoenix, can I ask you something? Do you really believe that Mr. Powers is innocent? I believe. Of course he is. That's all I wanted to hear. Excellent. I'll see you in court then. Great. Thanks, Mia. See you soon. Thank God. To be continued. All right. We're going to trial and we're going to be talking to a child. So it should be interesting. So in the next part, we'll be doing that. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all later.